So we've talked through all of the different aspects of the body and you guys now know the clock method, but there are still clients out there who will struggle with what you say. If you think about it, actually, I'll just tell you right now. I used to be a teacher. I used to be a high school teacher and we were taught that there were three kinds of learners, auditory, the ones who understand when it's written down in front of them, and then the majority of people. You know what they are? The visual learners. So if we can show them what we're looking for, it's gonna create that sense of, I understand now. If I ask you, take your left hip or your left hand and put it on your hip, take your right foot and cross it over your left. Some people are gonna put just like this. They're gonna put it right to their hip. I don't want this. I don't want them to actually put their wrist this way. So if I can show them rather than just tell them, we want them to be able to do that. For example, if I were to say, I would like your hands on your hips, I'm gonna ask them to actually take their hands like this and put them onto their hips because we don't want that broken wrist like we've talked about before. But if I show them that, they can understand that more fully. This is called mirroring. So take a look at how I do mirroring during an individual shoot and a couple shoot. All right, so we are out. We're gonna be doing a couple of different mini shoots today, mini sessions. The first one we have is just an individual. This is Kendall and her pup Grizz. So we're gonna walk through. I'm gonna instruct them on how to pose, everything like that. All right, so pull him a little bit closer to you. Yep, come on right over into this area right here. Good, yep, right there. Hey Grizz, can you sit? Can you sit? Oh. Good boy. Yes, so Kendall, take your leg. You're gonna pop it in front of the other one. Yep, so actually cross one leg just like this. Perfect, that hand goes onto your butt. Oh, yeah, yes, the phone, I love it. Hey Grizz. <laughs> Hi buddy. Oh my goodness, look at you little. Oh yes. Okay, so Kendall, come on down with him. Wrap your arms around him. Oh, Grizzers, yes. So look down at him, Kendall, perfect. Hey, Grizz, whoop, ooh. Oh my goodness, good job. All right, stand on up. Oh, stand up, good boy. Okay, so what you're gonna do, oh, high five. Yes, oh my goodness, good job, buddy. You guys are gonna walk away from me for a second. Go on, go for a walk. Yes, you got it, Kendall. <laughs> I love it. And then come on back towards me, Kendall. Come on, Grizz. Woo and stop. Grizz, can you sit? Sit down. Good. Nope. Sit. Good boy. Wait. Wait. Throw that hat right on your head. Yes. Oh my gosh. I love it. Perfect. So what we're going to do is you're going to hold on to that. Yep but we're just gonna cross our arms like this. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. You got it, I'm, I'll touch that part out. All right, Grizz, woo. Good job, buddy. Oh, woo, woo. Grizz, can you give high fives? Go give high five. Good boy. Dancy, dancy, I love it. Perfect, good job, buddy. Okay, so take a knee. Mm. Yep, she's gonna come next to you. Move the leash behind him a little bit. Yes, there we go. Hey, Grizz. Whoa, Bubba. Yes. Hello, buddy. Hi, Grizz. Hey, Grizz. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. And then snuggle your face into his. Oh, 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 oh. Yep, there you go. Good job, Grizz. Okay, so Kendall, what I want to do is I want to actually take your hat and put it on him. Okay, Grizz, wait, wait. Stay. Stay. Wait, nope, you're good. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Yes, Grizz, good job, buddy. Can you lay down? Perfect. Good job, Bobs. Good boy, stay, wait. Oh my goodness. Good job, buddy. You got it. Okay, hand me your, the hat for a second. Perfect, so 
what I'm gonna have you do, so come on this way just a little bit further. And then all I want you to do is you're gonna walk like you're a model, like a model, like a model. Like a model. Ready, Grizz? Here we go. Yep. Yes. That is kind of, I love it. So Grizz, go right next to her and make him sit next to you. Oh, buddy, a little closer. Oh, bud, come here. Come here, Grizz, come here, come here. Come on, good boy. Perfect, that's good, just like that. So what I'm gonna have you do is you're gonna just flip your hair a couple of times. Yes, but look out this way. Okay. All right, ready? One, two, go. One more time. Ooh, I love it. Oh my gosh, that's so freaking cute. Adorable, Ooh. I know, right? All right, so come on next to him. Lay down, Grizz. Down. 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 So you're going to lay down next to him. All the way down next to him. Okay. Yep, all the way. Yep, so on the on your stomach. Okay. Oh, Grizz. What you doing, buddy? Yes. Good job, bud. Yeah. And then look right at him and have him. Glizzy. Perfect. Kendall, that's it. We're good. Good job, Grizz. Good job, buddy. Thanks, pal. Okay, so we're going to go over this way. So I'm going to go through a bunch of different poses with you guys. Okay. I'll tell you exactly what to do, everything like that. We're just going to use this space. It's so pretty out. Oh my, well, that's why we came in the shade too. It's shady. Right. I think shade's better lighting. I do too. I do too. I, and I, let's be honest, like with the way that the summer's been, it's been way too hot for way too long. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Meh, you like the heat? He loves it. He okay. Well, that makes a big difference then. Okay. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to do a bunch of walking poses. Okay. So you guys are just going to grab hands. So you're going to walk away from me. Yes. There you go. Look at each other as you walk. Go for it. <laughs> yes, you should. That's true. Ready? Go. Perfect. So stop right there. You're going to hold hands again. And we're going to do what I like to call the drunk walk. Okay, so you're gonna bump into each other. Do not knock her over. Okay, you can try if you want to. <laughs> She's like, all right, I got this. <laughs> That's all right, ready? Yep, look at each other as you walk. So you're just gonna kind of walk, boom, boom. Right, one, two, boom, ready? One, two, go. Perfect, you guys, that's great. Okay, so the next one, you're just gonna take your hands around each other's backs. Yep. Let me grab your wallet out of the back pocket real quick. This is how I make my money. I'm just kidding. <laughs> that's right, all right. So you're just gonna walk away from me, look at each other as you go. Go for it. Stop right there. Keep looking at her, Madison. Nope, so keep your arms around each other. Madison, you're just gonna peek over at me. Yes. Oh, I love it. And then nuzzle your nose into her ear for me. Yes. <laughs> okay. You're going to grab onto her arms. So put your arms out like this. Okay. You're going to make her fly like an airplane. Yes. Bigger points even. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> okay. Your favorite part. It's the bed. No, don't move from there. Go back there. Okay. <laughs> That's amazing. So take your hands out like this. Put your hands right on top of hers. So you're going to wrap his arms into you. Ready? Yes. Oh, that's so cute, you guys. Yes, you got it. That's adorable. All right. And then I know you're going to be amazing at this one. Ready? You're going to whisper her favorite dessert, but in a Cookie Monster voice. Ready? Into her ear. Here we go. One, two, go for it. <laughs> That's amazing. You were great at that. I love it. What was it? What's the, what is it? What's bazooki? Ice cream on it. That's what that's called? A bazooki? Oh, I just call that the Drake's cookie. Have you ever gone to Drake's? Yes, they have it at Drake's. Um, BJ's. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, 
So we're gonna actually go just like this into an angle V. Okay. Yep, your bodies. Mm -hmm. Typical pose where you show off that ring, put it right onto his chest. Oh yes, just like that, that's perfect. Hand into a pocket for me, always with the thumb out. Yes, this guy looks so good. Oh, I love it. The key with mirroring is that you have to be able to practice it. You have to be able to go home, look in the mirror and understand what you're doing is what somebody else is seeing. You need to go home and you need to practice. Figure out what your client is seeing. Go in front of a mirror and do the poses that you're asking them to do. Understand those little nuances and it's gonna be easier for you to show them that small turn, the angle of the hip, the changeover of your hands from this to this, right? So if you understand what you're looking for, your client is better gonna be able to visualize it through the use of you. Hope that this helps. The next segment that we're gonna talk about are all of the different poses and the prompts that you can use to get your clients there. See you later.